pleasant greetings to all in this video i am going to solve some of the previous ies and gate problems so first problem the flow of electric current in a conductor is due to the flow of electrons only second problem the electric current is the movement of free electron predominantly in one direction Next problem, copper has a resistivity of 17 into 10 power minus 9 ohm meter. What is the end to end resistance of the copper strip that is 2 cm long with cross sectional dimensions 5 mm into 1 mm? So first of all you have to write the given data or data given. Rho value is given. 17 into 10 power minus 9 ohm meter and next length is given that is in centimeter you have to convert the centimeter into meter 2 into 10 power minus 2 meter again the cross sectional dimension is given that is 5 millimeter into 1 millimeter convert this into meter so 5 into 10 power minus 3 into 1 into 10 power minus 3 that is equal to 5 into 10 power minus 6. Afterwards find out the value r. r is equal to rho into L by A. So rho value is known 17 into 10 power minus 9 into L is 2 into 10 power minus 2 meter then divided by 5 into 10 power minus 6. Here that reduce this 34 divided by 5 into 10 power minus 11 plus 6. So 34 divided by 5 into 10 power minus 5. Have to cut this we get 6.8. Now I have to Multiply both numerator and denominator by 10, 10 power minus 5. The answer is 68 into 10 power minus 6 or 68 micrometer. Next problem, condition for the validity of the Ohm's law is that, what is Ohm's law? At constant temperature or temperature constant T constant V is directly proportional to I. Here also the condition is temperature should remain constant. Next question for a fixed supply voltage the current flowing through a conductor will increase when it's okay supply voltage is fixed. So what about I? I is equal to V divided by R. V is fixed. That is constant. So R is equal to rho into L by A. From this equation, I is inversely proportional to L. So I is increased when L is decreased. So when its length is reduced. Thank you. Have a nice day.